remembering 9-11 through art. Students and teachers are working together at Buford Middle School, making these origami peace cranes to honor the lives lost on September 11, 2001. Each paper crane representing one person that died during the 9-11 terrorist attacks. So in our art gallery, we have two big glass display cases. Each one represents a tower. And we filled up those paper cranes, all different colors, kind of representing different backgrounds of people, the diversity that was uh, the people in the tower. Students worked hard learning how to fold the paper cranes. We had to make 2,977 cranes because that's how many people died. Students also produced a special edition of their morning newscast focusing on 9-11. At 9.37, hijackers crashed a plane into the Pentagon. During the broadcast, students shared poems, the band played a song, and a student read a speech by then-President George Bush. This is a day when all Americans from every walk of life unite. It was about what the impact on 9-11 had on this country and how they were going to stand strong against it, and that they would come together and start fighting it back against terrorism. The Peace Crane Project is helping students learn about the impact of the 9-11 terror attacks. It's important that we learn about our 9-11 history because it shows the bad and the good side of this world. The bad side being the terrible people that did this and that they should be held accountable for it. And the good side of that, how people can come together and stand against what's wrong. But us go back to show them how to overcome adversity, reflect on how damaging hate can be and that love can heal. The September 11 terror attacks happened 21 years ago at Buford Middle School, Ron Lopes, Buford County School District.